people that within three years, I notice a change. One in style that we just talked about, but also just in the number of people who are here to do their own thing, and it's good stuff. There's definitely a, a, a new a new energy that I didn't see here so much before. Um, and that, par that parallels, for me, what's going on um, in New York. There are some people here in menswear, you probably know Armour, uh, who are, 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 are taking some chances and stepping out. Totem on uh, South Street, you know, really are putting Philly, art in the age, sort of, you know, putting Philly kind of on the map with style, and, and I think in a really good way. Brooklyn, I, I would always do markets, and I had a small community of friends that all did, you know, they made things or they sold clothes or whatever. And so that idea s sort of grew into the idea of a, of a Philadelphia collective. And I, cho I basically chose people that I've met here that make their own things that I think do really strong brands and really love what they do. This is a 70s denim uh, trucker jacket from Levi's. One of the things that's very exciting to me um, is to see this this sort of, I don't know if it's a renaissance or if it's its probably some sort of a renaissance of American, a, a, a real focus on um, American made goods and, and people building things um, with their hands and people taking, taking pride in you know what they what they buy, why they buy it. As a forager, I just really started to create uh, a mood board for all things forage that really related to the natural world. And then I just saw how it really became a clear brand in my mind. And I thought, okay, let's let's explore this idea of how it relates to clothing. And, uh, started working with a group of Mennonite women who sew vest and clothing for the traditional Amish community. From a 1940s men's suiting fabric quilt top. With the denim, I try to use denim that's been out of regular lines of consumption for at least five years, and the most of the woolen is between 20 to 100 years old. Mm -hmm. 